might be best to do so outside of the castle. Professor Fig and Weasley have asked that I teach you an additional defensive spell. Please complete the assignments I have given you, and then proceed to see me in my classroom. Ugh. Pungus onion again. Good morning, Professor Garlic. How wonderful it is to see you again, Lenora dear. Oh, here, you'll need these for today's class. Uh, um, uh, a little treat for your auntie. Ah, oh, hello, class. Please welcome the newest rose in our garden. We do look forward to growing together. How thrilling it is to have everyone back together again. This year will be filled with enchantment and excitement, but the most important thing cultivated in herbology is knowledge. The prudent herbologist is no more afraid of the venomous tentacula than the bouncing bulb. Then, today we will be acquainting ourselves with the mellifluous tuber known as the mandrake root. Accio. Let's see if we can't make our fibrous friends a bit more comfortable, shall we? <laughs> First, let's protect our ears. <laughs> now, everyone, Grip their mandrake by the tendrils and give it a firm tug. should envelop the root like a warm, dirty blanket, putting the mandrake right at ease. Repero! I'm very sorry about that. Yours was a bit mature, I'm afraid. All right then, off you go. Splendid work, everyone. Now, for our next task, we'll be planting dittany at our potting tables. You can all get started. I need to have a brief word with her. Incendio. It drifts like mock grass. Revelio. Levioso! Reparo! Levioso! Accio! Revelio! Incendio! Yes, Professor? Firstly, well done with your mandrake. They can be rather difficult to get a grasp of. Actually, I enjoyed it. I couldn't help but catch you. How kind of you. 
It seems you're already taking to Herbology like a mandrake to fresh soil. Now, as I mentioned, next we'll be planting Dittany. Let us find you some seeds. I already have some, Professor. Pick them up in Hogsmeade. You visited the Magic Neep. Wonderful! A prepared... I've arranged for you to have your own potting table here. Plant the seeds then. Let's see how to balance my star thistle arrangement. Dittany's restorative properties make it a vital ingredient in the Wiganweld potion, as you all should know from Professor Sharp's class. Well done! Once it can be harvested, your Dittany will be ready to use in Wiganweld potion. I'll let Professor Sharp tell you about that. Now! What say we branch out? Introduce you to a different sort of flora, the Chinese chomping cabbage. You'll find that some plants are better suited to uses outside of a cauldron. The cabbages do get testy without something to chew. Fortunately, I have a dummy for them to gnaw on. Be a dear and let them have a good chomping. Yes, Professor. They're in the other greenhouse. It's just at the end of the footbridge leading out of this room. Your classmate. Come back and see me when you're finished. Oh, and mind your fingers. They do. What should I be doing right now? I'd like you to get some hands-on experience. They're in the green. Hello. Saw you on your way to Hogsmeade the other day. Nice to meet you. Nice work in Defense Against the Dark Arts, by the way. Excuse me? Your duel with Sebastian. And he's good. <laughs> Thinks he's really good. But you outright slaughtered him. It was brilliant. Oh. Well, thank you. Here we are. Home of the Chinese Rebellion. chomping cabbage. Go. Now, see that dummy? Just toss the cabbages at it. And they'll do the rest. Incendio. Levioso. Accio. Protego. Revelio. I'm sorry. Levioso. Accio. Look at that! Well, I don't anything they can get their uh, mouths on. <laughs> Mum planted some in her garden last year to keep the gnomes out. Did save her the denoming, but they left her honking daffodils in tatters. I'm... Vicious little... Uh, not saying you can't... Nice. Take your time. I'll see you back in class. And with that helpful reminder as to why we should always wear our dragon hide gloves... I tended to the Chinese chomping cabbages, Professor. Remarkable plants, aren't they? I hope they weren't too much trouble. Oh, don't see any bite marks or missing digits. And good, as you do seem to be... Magical plants. I'm glad. Huh. Well, I suppose that's... Uh, 
mandrakes are really relishing their new pots. <laughs> 